Hey guys, welcome back to Oxygen Not Included, Clay Space Colony game where we are playing in the Optimistic Pig Pen, or at least that is the name of this colony. And we've got a few things to attend to today. The first, I think, is the fact that we are currently having a poo inside just like this ceramic fake hole and then make, letting it compost down. Now this is kind of okay, but it's given us a bit of an excess of fertilizer. If we come over and have a look in this storage compactor, we've got more fertilizer than we have algae. There's no algae in here. Oh, because algae is kept down here, of course. But we, yeah, we've got more fertilizer than we have most of anything else. So we need to, uh, need to try and sort that out. This, of course, is all dependent on the sanitation sciences, which we have already got for the lavatory and the shower but also the percolation sciences because I would like to not only use the electrolyzer to make extra oxygen but get the water purifier on the go because that's quite a big thing uh, the thing holding us back back from the electrolyzer is what do we do with the hydrogen uh, I've, I've got an idea but it's gonna take a while to get there another problem that we've got is the lack of hydrogen, uh, lack of hydrogen, lack of algae that we have on the go at the moment. So I think I need to kind of boost up some of this digging over here so we can get over to that algae. I'm wondering if there's anywhere, like, there are little patches around, but I think this is the next big one we want to go to. So what I'm going to do is prioritize this up to an eight and hopefully someone will come along and do this job uh, whilst at the same time keeping the colony ticking over we're kind of all right at the moment just to just to be like knocking over the the daily activities and things do kind of work out a-okay for us i'm also going to go ahead oh i cannot put a priority on this one where's the priority meter gone should we try that again there we go uh, sometimes the priority meter either fails to show up or shows up in places you don't expect it to uh that that's a-okay -okay, though you know we can we can get around that sort of stuff uh another thing i would like to do is start laying down the foundation work for the lavatory and shower this includes like putting a liquid pump in we're gonna put it this side no, actually, we're going to put it on the other side. The reason for that being is we can then run the power and stuff up this up at the side of the ladder, uh, and that should help everything work out. Okay, let's move over towards the sandstone. That's the thing we need. Line this up here. Now, this is where we're going to have the toilet and the shower and stuff like that. What's resource eaten? Oh, we got a little hatch up there. We'll have a look at that in a second. So I'm going to run this up to the roof of the sanitation area because I like to try and keep my clean water and dirty water set. So we're going to go up with clean and down with dirty. We can do like all sorts of processing under here and that should make everything uh, work exactly as we like. I'm also going to get the heavy wattage in and run that in the same place. Unfortunately, I did appear to miss somewhere here, but we can fix that. Yeah, okay, cool. But So we need to get these guys going around and doing the jobs. I'm just wondering whether we want to start building the infrastructure for the toilets here, if I was to, say, get the plumbing and, like, do we have room for a shower? We do have room for a shower here, so let's put one of those there. Do we want a shower block, in fact, have two of them? Uh, yeah, let's do that and leave room for a... Where is it? I wanted to click on the right thing. The blank canvas. So that, that should keep things, like, spiffingly nice for our duplicates here. Because we like to have a spiffingly nice colony, right? Surely that, that's what we want. That's, that's what I want, anyway. Uh, we're going to have to think about a new way of accessing the water. The, all this stuff I don't think is going to work out for us. I would also like to put a vent inside here, maybe? Just to keep all this clean. How is this going, actually? Um, I, can't, I can't actually get a, a sort of idea of how much oxygen we have in here. Because, obviously, this is producing... Where, where does it tell us? Somewhere it will tell us how much contaminated oxygen it's making. It's not called contaminated oxygen anymore. It's called uh, polluted oxygen. There we go. Polluted dirt. No, polluted dirt. It doesn't, it doesn't actually tell us. Emitting fertilizer? No. But you can see there's stuff coming off there. And if I was just to leave it, it would uh, produce lots of polluted oxygen. And then this will fix it. Will it actually fix it? I hope so. Maybe I want to build one of these on the other side as well. I'm going to give it a go. I'm going to put one down there. I'm going to go for the oxygen, the air deodorizer. Let's pop that in that place there. Put that on a nine. Put this on a nine. Okay, that's all A-OK. -okay. Nighttime approaches and we can have an extra duplicate. I, I didn't actually see this roll in. So let's do this overnight. What are we going to do here? Twin toes and small bladder that's a, a fair fair one to go for there we could definitely go with that amphibious that's nice can't dig and loud sleeper 
two not too bothery ones there, but I think cumulatively that's quite bad. Irritable bow takes a little longer to do business, and this is has to do it more often. Okay, uncultured athletic six. Hmm, it's 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 hard to choose. It's hard to choose. I think what I'm gonna do is go for Ren over here. We're gonna rename him because someone has asked me to give him a duplicate during my stream on Saturday, and I was like, yeah, you know what? We can do so. We also need to rename one of the other duplicates somewhere. We should have Harold. What what a terrible name for a duplicate. And we want this guy to be Donald. Uh, Don. Donald, yeah, there we go, I can type. Donald O'Connor, in fact, who was a, a dude who came along uh, for Kerbot Wars, uh, was involved in that. He, he did the javelin, that was an amazing craft. He had a, a rocket-propelled weapon on it. It was, it was good, it was good. Uh, but yeah, he, he asked if he could have a duplicate, so I was like, yeah, of course not, why not? Okay, everyone's decided that now is the time to eat. Unfortunately, this leaves us with a little bit of a food problem on the go. It's not a, it's not a major food problem, just a little bit of a food problem. I'm pretty sure if I do that, that should solve a few of our issues. We'll get mill lice and bristle blossoms. I've also noticed there's some stuff on the floor here. I don't like having stuff on the floor. It absolutely destroys the decor. I mean, I mean, literally totally destroys it. If I have not shown you guys in the past, let's go down here. You can see the debris has got a minus 41 on it. The planter box itself isn't doing too well, but yeah, there's something to bear in mind. If you are doing your uh, little, little space colony here, you need to be able to sweep up the floor if you want people not to be stressed. Okay, people are going along and picking up most things, but I see there may be a few issues here. You can see we've got our metal uh, metal storage here. It is absolutely rammed full, so I'm going to turn this one on as well. Up here, everything seems to be okay. What have we got being stored in here? This is dirt with another box of dirt next to it. And then the filtration medium, sand and cultivatable store uh, even more dirt so this is like all the dirt is being filled up here we've got a little bit of sand i might put another one of sand on the end here or again we could probably do with actually butterflying out and having more storage compactors i was kind of hoping someone would come up and start digging this algae by now I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and put this in at a nine it's it's, it's getting a little much how many nines I have on the map, but I would like to actually see some more algae come in before we have to start thinking about expanding to other types of production. Uh, we're, we're kind of a little bit behind here. Like, we're nearly in day 40 and we haven't upgraded even to actual toilets yet, so that would be good. But we've been making sure we've got our food sorted, our, our uh, science working well, we've got a good power grid on the go. So we've been doing things that are worth it, just... Uh, a little bit slow on the tech line. Uh, another thing I want to do is get some tiles. I'm going to put them in as a 9 for now, but they're not going to be able to access them, so it's not that much of a bother. Or maybe I could. Maybe we could just like fill it in like this, and then this entire box down here can be for oxygen production. I think that might be an idea. What I might do is put some extra tiles in to try and force all the oxygen into like maybe a central point somewhere or something like that. We'll have to see which side the oxygen wants to... Uh, wants to accumulate in. Uh, normally you end up with carbon dioxide settling in one side and oxygen settling on the other, so that'll be interesting to see. These guys going through and doing some digging here, that is good work, exactly the type of stuff we want to see. I am going to try and dig this out. I'm going to cancel this one. I want to build... How can we build him a little area back here? Like, if we do something like this, I'm just going to make it solid for now. No, I'm not. I'm going to I'm gonna go C and drop those two down. We're going to drop an airlock there. I want to dig all this out, and then I also want to put a storage compactor down. The whole point being is that we will put some sandstone in here during the day, uh, and then we'll drop some out at night, ready for him to eat stuff. He appears to have a whole load of stuff here. We've got sandstone, coal. How much coal we've got? We've got, like, nearly... Nearly a ton of coal. That is amazing. Oh, everyone's off to sleep already. I just kind of waffled my way through that day. Amazing. Perhaps we'd like to uh, up the priority of these jobs over here. I'm only up to about a seven or so, so let's uh, let's kick them down. I'll tell you something that does need to be top-notch is that uh, oxygen, well, oxygen cleaner. That, that's the one. Okay, there's not much in the way of decor going on in these guys' bedrooms, and this kind of makes me sad. So maybe we should uh, start thinking about getting some nice pa paintings and stuff like that up and around. So how can we do this? Go for the blank canvas, one of those. Maybe one above each 
each bed. This kind of feels nice. If we could, I would make it a little personalised uh, painting above each person's bed so everyone can have their own painting, whether that be a loved one or themselves, depending on how narcissistic they are. I mean, that would be a good idea. Why is there no power, guys? Like, honestly, there's important jobs. Important, important jobs. What else have we put in at the nine to make it so... Ah, oh, it's all the uh, the picking up of the copper, isn't it? Okay. Well, let's just let that run through. I'll bring you back when they finish sweeping. So they have all but sweeped up all the copper. There is still a little bit not knocking around here. I'm not sure why they're not dropping it off into this one, but for some reason they don't want to. But more importantly, these guys have got up towards these sort of giddy heights here. I'm just having a look around and seeing how I'm going to have to put down some ladders to enable them to get to all the different areas. Oh, look, we got some abyssalite here. Oh, look, overheat temperature plus 2,000. I wonder what that's about. That's that's quite a big number there. Okay, so anyway, these guys can only reach a certain distance out. So if I do that and also do this, it should enable uh, them to reach everywhere. I'm a little bit worried about the chlorine coming through here. Like, uh, when I say a little bit worried, I am super worried. So what I'm going to do is pop down a manual airlock on the nines. Of course on the nines. Why would that not be on the nines? Hopefully someone has some copper really close by to be able to get this fixed up. Okay, this should help us... Hopefully, hopefully. I, I can still see there being a little bit of a, a chlorine spill at some point and then this will all just get overwhelmed. Someone will walk through and then a massive cloud will whop down. Uh, hopefully, it will end up down here somewhere. Oh, look, someone's been digging some more algae. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Is there any more big algae patches anywhere? There kind of are mini ones on the side of things, but not anything that I'm getting too excited about we could get a few off the top there you know i think i'm gonna prioritize these one i'm also gonna prioritize these two because it's about time they got dealt with and so i'm gonna go on the the g9 of course let's pull those down now i want to get ladders about that far below so people can see what's going on and so people can reach sorry i was thinking about headroom see what's going on i'm not sure where that came from but yeah that was a thing so that's all good algae still getting dropped off and we can take on another duplicate how is our food situation going we're still on the way up with the food i don't i don't see any issues with food so i'm going to carry on going on and getting some more people i see harold is back we've already renamed him and he's like no 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 this is not how it's going to work we're going to be back I'm like oh cheers I uh, can't dig it in scaredy cat, uncultured. I'm not, N N Lindsay, you're not, you're not winning me over, I have to say. You are a physician, though, and that could be useful at some point, but I'm not sure. Uh, I like the high athletics. It means people can get back and forth pretty quickly. All right, Harold, welcome back to the fold, man. Welcome back. Everyone else should be getting a new friend buff. That's pretty cool. Uh, who can we send here like super kitty's got like wounds uh rock runner doesn't so let's just send super kitty here uh, is that gonna happen straight away that is there we go now, i've got to try and figure out who else has light wounds and how to fix them okay so nads is the next person so if we can clear super kitty off of here hopefully this science is going to be getting done soon uh so nads was the next person now that super kitty's left i assume that they are done uh Ikroy, no I, I don't think anybody else. ah donald You've got you've got some wounds there. Let's let's wait for Nads to get all completely healed up. I wonder how long that's gonna take. It doesn't say. It does say she's sleeping though. That's uh, interesting. I would say more lying down rather than sleeping. I don't know if there's uh, actually that much of a difference between the two. They're on sevens. That's all good. Are people gonna be able? To, yeah. Well, there's ladders, so they should be able to reach there. Uh, now the going in can be nice and direct. So this one nice and direct like this but the coming out we need to leave room for a lot of the wastewater because if these back up into each other then they're going to back up and not allow people to have proper proper showers because the water won't be able to drain uh, i think this might have been what the problem was with our previous colonies where people were having trouble uh, uh, taking the shower Okay, can we get this up to a nine? No, this one up to a nine. I would like this to be done. I need, I need this science, guys. I really need this science. I might even put all of this up to a nine and say like science is one of the most important things to deal with, just so we can move the game on a little quicker. It, it might be helpful. Okay, I shoved all these up to a nine because, as I say, I want to kind of move this game on and, like, standing around waiting for all the duplicates to finish all their other jobs before we get on with this. It's just getting a little bit much, you know, so let's watch these guys finish their jobs here. Hopefully someone's up here. Yeah, we've got Derpy McDerp face 
getting the work done. How much more work needs to be done? Another seven or so, and then we're going to put the combustion up. I'm actually tempted to move the science up a little bit, because I want to expand the mess hall here and make it just a little bit nicer for more people. We'll also have, like, more food storage and things like that up there. I think that would be a great idea. I'm also tempted to, now that I've put this up, completely scrub this bit here. You know what? I'm going to do it. Uh... Sweet air deodorizer. There we go. I want to deconstruct and I also want to deconstruct you there. Uh, I'm then going to deconstruct this outhouse. I don't know if I'm going to do it straight away. I'm not sure if I'm going to do it straight away, but I am going to deconstruct this outhouse and put a proper toilet down, a lavatory. We'll put that there. And that should give us enough room for a lot of things. I'm wondering if I can do a little set like these to give extra room for the liquid drainage. That would, that would be nice, right? Have all this turn, turning up like that. Yeah, I think that's a thing. We've got polluted dirt and uh, all sorts of stuff. What, what was that? That was the research being completed. Awesome. That means in this refinement here, I can make us a water purifier. Now, we're probably actually going to need more than one. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a thing here. I'm going to dig out this floor. And then I'm going to put down tiles there and tiles here. And that should leave room for two of these. I'm uh, hoping two should be good enough. We could even run the toilet into this top one. Mm, yeah, I'm a little worried that I won't have enough room, but we're, we're gonna see we're gonna see how it plays out. We're gonna see how it plays out. Let's prioritize these up nice and high as well, just to get this all turning over. I'm gonna deconstruct this building and get the toilet lined up. Of course, these guys have decided now is the time to do other things. So whilst they're doing that, I'm gonna come over here and have a look at this sort of area. This is all going to be sort of for later, but what I'd like to do is put down a whole load of tiles here, so, sort of like this. This seems like a good idea. Maybe a manual airlock either side. I have no idea on the sizing of this yet. I may have just made a big mistake, but in the refinement we can put down a couple of bio distillers. That was quick. Let's put that on this speed. Uh, yeah, literally just a couple of bio distillers, and we will come back to do this in a second whilst I go over and have a look at what's going on over this Way. Hopefully people are building some stuff. The what, one thing people aren't building is the lavatory because I didn't get down to putting it in place. Uh, decor is plus 10 on the copper, so one, always want to have my uh, my decor as high as possible. Are these are the no, they're not the other way around. They're the same way around. I should really learn to uh, build my things taking this into account. Uh, but I don't because I don't remember things like that. So that that's an interesting fact about me there. Let's pull these all down here. Let's pull all these down as well. Get some li more liquid pipes on the go. If I can go down and then like that, I'd also like to go like that. And hopefully that's enough room there to not back up the pipes. That That's kind of the hope. That is kind of the hope. Uh, let's let them run through it. I don't know why I paused it there. That's <laughs> just meant that I need to uh, try and think of other things to say whilst we watch these guys go around and do things. I'm not sure what's going on elsewhere. Let's have a look at these uh, these algae concentrations over here. Now, these are all working out okay. There's more algae over this way. I'd kind of also... Oh, look at this algae. And there's a puffed. That's, uh, that's nice. How do we get him into a better situation? How do we start clearing this water out as well? That's another question. I think what I'd like to do, this is probably going to be setting up for the future. Run this down here like that and then have some tiles going across this way. And then if I put a G... Oh, look. Algae up here. But let's do this. And of course we'll need a manual airlock. Some, somewhere about there. I think. That, that that kind of screams correct to me, but we'll, we'll come back to that. Are we still not producing enough oxygen? I wonder how stressed people are by not breathing. I mean, like, we are literally just under the amount we need to produce. and There's no no power being made because I prioritised this lot so high. Of course. Let's get someone on the art job. And then I just suddenly thought that We've had a few new people, so they're, they're not going to be able to do art. And Donald, I'm afraid you can't do art either. Okay, that, that's all good. Uh, let's get rid of all that. Need to think about how we're going to better organise all this stuff here. I think the way I might do it... Can we move this ladder over one? Put an airlock here, fill this in. Yeah, that, that's what's going to happen. Okay, let's pull this down here and deconstruct all of those. Hopefully someone will get straight on that. That's pretty good how they do the jobs that I just set for without actually going to finish the other jobs I've set them. Um, yeah, I'm not sure I'm actually overly impressed with that, but that's what they do, so we will just live with it. Uh, and then put another ladders 
here like this. Okay, yes, awesome and so convoluted. Let's put that down like this. Another manual airlock. Uh, could you could you break that one for us, please, guys? Just just this one here. Is it not set up to? Uh, no, it is. It does say it needs to be deconstructed. But someone, whoever is in charge of that, thinks that oxygen is more important. I mean, like, whoa, what a what a crybaby, hey. Uh, let's put this down in as that as well. Let's check our priorities here. Yeah, no, it's looking good. It's looking good. Nads has come along to make this place look and smell fine. Uh, anything else we need to do? I think maybe destroying this middle bit in a second will also be a good idea. Uh, they're not going to have any outputs, of course. Of course, that's a thing. Power, however, can just kind of root through them both. So this is going to be outputting clean water. Where do we want clean water to go? Do we want to just kind of throw it back in there for now? Just just for now. I'm not sure what we're going to do with it, Elsa. We will come up with an idea later. Let's put that there. That's too far away, isn't it? Okay, let's, let's think about this. Let's be smart. If I come up here and across like that... Yeah, I'm not, I'm not overly loving it, but I'm, I think it's going to have to be something we work on. Okay, let's pull this down here like this. Are they going to be able to reach that stuff? I'm not sure. Let's, uh, let's give it a high priority and see what happens. I mean, I suppose at the same time, we could uh, throw a bunch of tiles across so that they do feel like they can get through there. Okay, that's good. You see these ladders here? I'm going to do my best to deconstruct just them without deconstructing. Oh, actually, it would be nice to just leave them there. So, for maintenance and stuff like that, because we're going to end up with a lot of pipes and wires and, and all sorts of other things going on down here. This is going to be our, like, utility area. So, that, that should be something that can be, like, pretty messy, but with fully utility-only, not aesthetic stuff. Hey, what's going on here? Abe? Is it Abe? No. Donald, Donald, you've got the spores, buddy. That's um, that's disgusting. How do you get the store, the spores? Let's have a look. The spores uh, is a walking fungal pod contracted by standing in a toxic area. That's got to be this area, right? It's got to be. Uh, how are these guys doing on the in and out pipes? Not, not too hot. Not too hot. Let's uh, let's get these all worked out here like this. Nope, that's not how you click and drag a box. That is, though. Everybody else coming to do the jobs? We've got some works to do. People doing some works. Look at these guys doing the showers, but even though they're not hooked up yet. Disgusting. Disgusting. It's, it's a bunch of savages. Can't even wait. Can't even wait. It'd be really nice if they could just do the power lines here. They are in a nine, so I'm not sure what... Harold, you're just letting all the oxygen out, man. What's, what's going on there? Can't you see this is a preserved environment? In fact, that's going to be very hot as well, isn't it? So, I don't know. It swings and roundabouts there. Swings and roundabouts. Where are you two going? What? You, got, you guys have got beds. Why did you come in here? Ah, because you can't get out yet. You know what? You, you can just stay there. I, I, I literally don't mind. Oh, what's he doing now? He's going to do some midnight workings. I'm not going to argue too much with this, actually, to be fair. If he can't sleep, then, you know, let's just see what he'll do about it. Come on, Harold. You, you're our man. Are you going to go around and do all the jobs that need to do? He really is. Uh, no oxygen here. That's fine. Can you deal with that, though? I think he's, yeah, he's going to dig his way out and go to bed. He's like, I've, I've had enough of sleeping rough on these floors. There's nothing quite like sleeping in your own bed. And then morning comes around, and we're like, lol... Uh, so, it was a good effort. It was a good effort, Harold. Uh, this Jupy Majuke face, like, making bad smells. Oh, he's got sore back, grimy back, dirty hands. Ah, oh, people are having a shower. Now, is everything getting uh, cleaned through quick enough? No. Okay, this is something that really, really needs to be addressed. Like, guys, just just here. These these two here. No power, no power. Oh, no, no, no. The, the, whilst, yes, no power. That's not what we're supposed to be looking at. It's the heavy watt wire. There is no reason for this not to have been fixed up yet. Come on. You can do it. But on Now there's just no power. Guys? No, well, there goes Donald. That's that's cool. And Jupin McJupe face, are you in on the game as well? You're not. Okay, that's unfortunate. I would, I would really like people to get on the power front. Did I go ahead and do this? I didn't. Let's let's get that combustion going. Let's get that combustion going. I have just noticed that I have been recording for a great long time. So let's just make sure all these are going to get dealt with, and then I will wrap up for the day. People still delivering coal down here. That's nice, actually. That is very nice. Okay, there goes some sand. That's pretty cool. That should drain out all the shower here. Now, is it? F 
no power. Somewhere here is water. Okay, so yes, it is starting to back up, but we have a little bit of a... Uh, a sump, a backlog, a, way, a place for stuff to go and sit. So this should be... Yeah, look look how quickly it's all getting cleared through. No one's abandoning showers at any point. Okay, I think all this excess water pipe here has done us the world of good. Okay, that's cool. That That is super cool. So it's just given me a little blip for f food shortage, but I have also at the same time just ordered a harvest on all our crops here. So that should be nice and good. These guys are running around and building up some power and I've set this up here to a higher priority because I'd like them to come along and fix this for me or at least get a work on is the rock runner gonna go around and do the job he is just sorting out some copper what do you want the copper for buddy what's that ah so these guys are managing to overheat the supercomputer that that is a, a thing that we were aware of I might even have to start thinking about how to uh, restrict what it's doing yeah I'm not I'm not sure there uh, like there is a uh, thermometer switch a temperature switch is that something we've got access to here liquid valve liquid filter no I can't I can't see the actual thing that I'm looking for here but I do know somewhere in the science we've got the temperature switch yeah right there the thermo switch uh, so at some point we could probably do something active and management wise there but with that, I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you next time when we're going to go around and do all these crazy things. And, of course, get this algae boiling sludge maker thing up and running so we can get ourselves more and more oxygen. But I will see you then when we're going to do that.